Ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> uh, guys, welcome in. You know what? Because I'm eccentric, because I'm elite when it comes to video making, I've thought of an amazing idea. You know what? Look at this $5 mystery box. I'm not going to do that, but I am going to look for like a little sports autograph mix mystery box. We'll do a little order right now. It is Monday. It is the 8th. This will be a week-long vlog. It's a whole big thing. And we're just going to go to one of these random mystery boxes. Here, 60 bucks, guys. Should I drop 60 bucks on, oh, a jersey? That's probably going to be, oh, DK Metcalf, Tyreek Hill, Johnny Football in there. Mystery mini helmet. I'm not dropping 200 bucks, man. What, 59? All right, so here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to get one of these $60 ones, whether it's a foot. I'll probably do the mini helmet. I feel like... Like, if I do a jersey, they're not going to give me any good players because the jersey, I guess, technically costs money. And if it's 60 bucks, I feel like my best bet is with a mini helmet. But the jersey, if it's a good player, dude, I mean, if it's like Mahomes or someone, I mean, realistically, if I'm doing something like this, you're hoping for like a franchise quarterback, specifically Mahomes, Josh Allen. Could you imagine a Josh Allen jersey signed? Uh, or like Otani, Trout for baseball. You know, maybe DeGrom, Julio Rodriguez, Okunia, and then for basketball, I mean, Curry, Durant, LeBron, someone like that. But I like the look of a mini helmet, though, a, a mini helmet auto. So I think I'm going to do the mini helmet. It's gotten a little four out of five stars. All right, let's see. What, what are the reviews here? 4.2. I mean, what players did you get? You got to tell me which players you got, though. These seem like, ooh, a, a, a Debo Samuel auto. So guys, I'm going to try and get an auto and and like sell it and see how much I can sell it for. Hopefully it's like, this This, this is the plan. I'll, I'll, I'll open it on camera. It, it'll cost me 70 bucks or whatever the hell it costs. What does it cost? Cost 60 bucks plus shipping plus, is there shipping on this? All right, we'll see. Let's see if there's shipping on this. Doobie doobie. Here's the plan. This is what I'm going to do. All right. There's, well, it says it's going to be calculated. God damn it. This is the plan. I'm going to buy this and then whatever I make, I'm going to sell it online and then I'm going to take all the money I made from selling it and then I'm going to buy something else. The hope is maybe I get like a Mahomes mini helmet and I can sell it for like $300 or something. I got to fill out all this shit. Hold on. Dude, I'm not, you're, 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 you're asking me to like fucking sign over my life by doing this privacy shit. What do you think I'm going to do? Go to a random website and, and friggin enable stuff. It just doesn't make sense. Oh, this is free shipping. Oh my God. I think I sniped one. Hold on. You gotta be kidding me, man. All right, so I just said, you know what? I'm not going to sit here and go through an essay exam with this thing trying to find a discount code. I'm just going to order it. I don't need a discount code. $72.81. We know I'm going to get screwed, guys. Let's be honest. I'm going to get a scrub. I'm going to get someone terrible. But at least I have it documented. At least I have it documented. This could be a massive waste. We'll have to see when it comes. I think it goes. I, I, I'll compact this down to what do you think? I'm thinking it probably compacts down to like 11 or 12 minutes. Normally, this doesn't happen. Normally, I don't have to edit like this. The issue is I just did a video. Uh, there were some per pronunciation issues. You know, it wasn't a sports video. There's going to be problems. I'm trying to do the, some mega projects and things like that. So this is what I picked up. These are just, I heard good things about them. I mean, it's whatever, dude. What is this? Blue raspberry. This is going to be bad on my throat. <laughs> that came out wrong. That's, but no, it's going to, it's probably going to hurt my throat a little bit. This Skittles flavor. I mean, we'll see. What is there? 200 milligrams in this. And then I, I've actually, the thing with Prime, what I'll say about Prime 
I mean, 25 calories, it tastes artificial. I would not recommend drinking it by itself, but like for a drink, if you want something low calorie to like, you know, quench your thirst while you're working out, I would say, I would say Prime's probably, or definitely better than Body Armor. I mean, Body Armor to me is not good. Prime is kind of one of those things, like if I was younger, dude, I would be drinking the fuck out of this shit. Um, just every day, but like, I just can't drink it. Like I need, I need to mix it with water. It's just too sweet. It's really artificial, but it does. There's like something about it to where it kind of tastes like Gatorade. Like it, it gives you, it feels like it gives you energy during workouts, but like I have to mix it with water. It's so damn like sweet, but it's all artificial. It's only 25 calories. And then obviously this shit's just, it's, it's horrible for you, but I mean, who really cares, you know, but guys, take a look at this. This is the crazy thing about, oh my God, is it raining? This is a crazy thing. Dude, what is with the grass? We get these things that come up. I cut the grass four days ago. Look at how tall that is. How is that even – when it rains, this this grass goes on steroids. And the problem is we have the woods right there. So all the pollen and shit comes over here and all plants in here. And that's why our grass is all fucked up. And I don't know how to use fertilizer. This does not taste like Skittles at all. I'm just telling you guys. I don't know what the hell. It just tastes – it tastes like artificial sugar. That's it. There it is right there. It is shipped, and they shipped it out like an hour after I put it in. So, you know what, guys? We got a little mini helmet coming. I'll do a little unve un reveal. I'm feeling pretty good about it. Maybe it'll come tomorrow. It'll pro Honestly, it'll probably get here on Thursday, which if you order something on Monday, that's, that's pretty good. But uh, that's kind of the update. It is a nice day. We're finally getting some nice weather here. I mean, it's already in Tennessee. You gotta like that. It's it's already in Tennessee, apparently. It, Just writing down some ideas. Oh, that's nice. Very nice weather. It's about 8.40 right now. I always come out here when there's a nice sunset. We're so digital. It's constant looking at your screen. My job is looking at a screen, talking into a microphone. I mean, I'm looking at, I'm, I'm I technically, I'm doing that here, but it's just important, man. I'm not going to even be able to see any of this very soon when I leave. Guys, this is why you should always, you should never live in a fucking city. A big city, at least. It's horrible for your mental health. You should always live where you, you just got area. Dude, I gotta cut this bullshit. This stuff is on steroids, man. This stuff gets dropped into here from the trees. It gets dropped into here and then it just grows and it just won't stop growing. Dude, I think my camera is messed up. There's really nothing I can do, though. I think I've had this iPhone for f three and a half years. Almost four. <laughs> the iPhones are funny, man. Like, what do people think is going to happen to the iPhone? Are we really going to have an iPhone 27? Like, someone's got to replace the iPhone, man. Come on. They haven't done jack shit. They cre create the exact same thing every year. No one knows what iPhone they have because they're all the fucking same. I don't know if I have the 10, 11, 12. No one knows, man. So the nice lights we get. I posted this to my Twitter account. 
They're they're nice little lights. Come on. You know, it's a little bit, guys, I was just freaking the fuck out. I just got tailed by a cop in an SUV. I didn't know it was a cop until I looked in my rear view mirror and I was like, oh, that has a fucking cop plate. I was going 42 and a 35 and I just slowed it down. But thank God, dude. Thank God I realized that. Yeah, I mean, this is a, this is a little bit better than the other one for sure. It's got a nice little uh, little raspberry taste. Actually, it tastes like, no, I guess it does have a raspberry taste. It just tastes like, honestly, it tastes like, like blue sugary and then it just tastes like artificial sugar. All right, watch how much of a joke this thing is. Let, let, let me see if I can video this. Watch this. You see that? It's a fucking jump scare. They got the, the police lights on it when you go over the speed limit. I mean, what is going on? I got terrified the first time I saw that. I thought it was a cop or something. So it is coming tomorrow. This is a nice little, you know, style video. It's like a little daily update. But yeah, so you know what? I'm very, uh, I like that shipping time. I ordered on Monday, it gets here Thursday. And then I'll do my little reveal tomorrow. And and guys, honestly, after looking at some of the, the players, the mini helmets, things like that, I don't think this is a good investment. But what are you going to do? It's for a video. Maybe I'll get lucky. I'll get Mahomes. But whichever player I get, I will try and sell it on Mercari and see if I can make money. And then guys, take a look at this thing. Wait, where is it? Guys, should I buy this and, and build it for content? This thing is crazy. Actually, you know what? It's not this one. Yeah, th this one's cheaper, but it's the same amount of pieces. They've been, they've been saying this thing's really hard to build. This is a nice stealth bomber. It is a, that is sexy, man. I'm thinking of getting a giant set for content and then I'm build, I'll build it and get videos and then make the money back through the videos and stuff like that through ads. I don't know which set, which set should I get though. Where, let me look at the biggest sets. There's a sand crawler. Is the sand crawler here? Hold on. Go by price, hide low. They got the sand crawler. Yeah, I can get it cheaper than four hundred bucks. Oh, this thing is huge. This will probably be the final update until my uh, mystery box is supposed to arrive tomorrow. So I'm just gonna obviously film myself opening that up and then i'll probably just compilate put all these clips together i can't edit guys i just randomly throw shit together and then just upload it and think i'm a good uh what is it content creator i just uh, yeah i just can't edit anything but that's basically what i'm gonna do but i do like making these little clips it's a nice little I can't, I'm trying to get into a apartment and I don't have any credit and I keep telling these people I'm like listen I make four thousand five thousand dollars a month you know if it's a thousand dollar apartment I'm gonna be able to afford it but they don't want to hear that they want my credit I don't, how do how do I get past that if anyone knows it's bullshit I mean I should be able to get into an apartment I'm, I'm making way more than than required these apartments require three thousand a month i make like but then they're like oh who's your who's your employer google is my employer google is my employer if i say the n-word google is going to demonetize me that's who i have to answer to google is my boss they're my father i like i i don't know these people want my employer that's my employer they pay me money. I have analytics. I have analytics and, and revenue. And I paid $5,000 last year in taxes alone. Because YouTube doesn't even take taxes out of your payment. They, were, they don't do it. The government does it at the end of the year. 
So you guys have all your jobs and they automatically take the taxes out. Yeah, they don't do it with good with with YouTube. You get all the money and then they say shabam. The end of the year comes, bam, give me my $5,000. I'm like, "Bro, what the fuck?" Oh, hell no. But yeah, no, I had to pay $5,000. I'm like, "What in the hell?" But dude, I need this. I'm hoping for a Patrick Mahomes autograph mini helmet tomorrow. And then I'll sell it on Mercari. Yeah, we know it's going to be like Brock Osweiler or something. Yeah, they do construction back there. Thank God we got the, the green up down with some privacy. But yeah, guys, my package is coming. Uh, <laughs> that, that sounded a little off, but now I got to cut this grass. It's a, it's a joke. Let's see how close this guy lets me get to him. I'll leave you I'll leave you alone see they go down that little thing right there I got the the, the rabbit the rabbit noises and things like that you keep you get them closer we got it uh, uh, I'm gonna film myself I gotta film myself opening it honestly I'm just gonna open it I you know what I think it has I think it has a little it's got a little case around it, so that's very nice. Nice little added bonus there. We're gonna open this. I'm gonna give my live reaction. This is a mystery box mini little little helmet. So you get a little nice replica helmet. I'll I'll grade the quality of the mini helmet, and then we got the autograph. Looks like it's in another box. They package all these together like this, and here it is, right here. Miss, Jesus, man. The Philadelphia Eagles, I got, guys, this is what I was talking about. I knew it was going to happen. Philadelphia Eagles, Jalen Hurts, I think that's who this is. Philadelphia Eagle. It's kind of a weird helmet, kind of an old helmet. Where's the auto? They give you this. I gotta look this up. Enter the verification code. This is a fucking science experiment. What, like, I didn't, can you just tell me who it is? There it is right there. W0, is that it? Yeah, that's it. All right, let's see who we got. Well, you know, at least I, I got my money back, maybe. I'll probably lose a little bit on it, but it's it's not the worst thing in the world. I was hoping when I saw the helmet, it was going to be possibly Jalen Hurts, A.J. Brown, Devontae Smith, Keith Byers, you know, non-Hall of Fame player. But this is what they're asking for them. I, I don't know if any of them are selling for this much. Let's see. This is 54 bucks. Yeah, I'm going to lose money on this. That's a New York Jets one. Is that a big helmet or a... Oh, that's a mini helmet. Yeah, I think I'm probably going to lose uh, some money on this, probably. But, you know, it was fun. If you guys want me to open anything else up, I'll, maybe I'll do another video opening something. Nice little helmet. I'm going to put it back into the into its little case, though. And I, could, I honestly, I could probably sell this with how the market is and things, maybe for like $30 or $35. I don't think I could sell it for anything more than that on something like Mercari. So this is a final look at it. It looks pretty nice in the in, in the little box for sure. Uh, and I was probably able to sell it. You know, it does have some resale value. It's not like I got Ryan Lindley or any scrub like that. So well, at least, you know, if I wanted to, I'd be able to make some money back on it. But I don't know, guys, the real over under for this video. What is going to be my ad revenue for this video? I'm setting the over under at $10 because we know my vlogs, they don't do well, but I'm setting it at $10. We'll see if I can make the ad revenue back that I invested, which is $73. I don't think I will, 
but uh, we'll have to see if that happens. And then they give you two nice little boxes here. They're decent boxes. I can use them to like ship stuff out or something. I don't know. But guys, that is going to do it for this video. Make sure you're following me on Twitter. Link to that's always in the description.